everybody <laughs> so it's past what's the time it's past 4 p.m i think it's almost five from my eyes you can tell i haven't had much sleep i've been up since two feeding baby genesis almost every hour and my darling husband is sleeping enjoying himself anyway since i can't sleep i just thought about making this vlog um it is day six of having genesis tomorrow is his christening one of your guys so we don't throw a party <laughs> and it's the lockdown so it's just going to be you know having just family and our pastor over pray for him and we're also supposed to circumcise him tomorrow you're not going to see that video because i'm not going to be a party to that i cannot stand the pain i'm just going to run away <coughs> i think you guys should just go through today with me i'm just going to show you guys what i do in a day my new life so the first thing i do in the morning is actually take a shot of this mm -hmm. it's local vodka they call it ogogori sharp when you take it on your body it's gonna be hot but i take this every morning prepared by my mom it's just ogogo with some spices inside well immediately from those you know those spices they used to make pepper soup some of them a lot of them are inside so i just shake it and i drink so you're supposed to take it in the morning um not even this early but i'm a wiggle really high person so what i do is i wake up in the morning i take it so you can take me back to sleep and I take it after I finish feeding Genesis so I don't have to give him any alcohol before he's hungry again this would have really gone down the system so it has it's herbal it's hot and it's very good for the body and it's going to help also with your stomach and all of that so this is going to bring me back to sleep when I wake up I'll I'll give you guys the rest of the story <laughs> Guess what, guys? Baby's placenta is out today. Fell off. My mom noticed. I mean, she was about to take his bath, and then she noticed that it has gone off, which is really fast. Some children take a very long time. Abi, mommy. Hey, uh hey. -huh. This take a very long time. I will show you now. Well, don't be baby. He has had his bath. Um, he has eaten. Time to sleep. Now, this is the part I don't like. So, there's this thing my mom does. She would press my body. She would press my body with very hot water. To be honest, it has helped me um, with the circulation of blood. So, why I don't like it is because you know they're pressing your head. She pre there was one day I was even complaining. Next thing I heard was face the wall. She just got real. Just look at the monster. She's prepared to come and press on my body. Hi! That thing, I don't know who discovered it. But when you're done, your body will be free. And then, I mean, this is my stomach now. Um, just six days after I gave birth. Hopefully, before one month, this stomach will be in good shape. forgot I was vlogging. I mean today has been stressful. I know I said that I was going to get sleep but I still haven't gotten any sleep. The moment I tried to sleep in the morning 
Genesis woke up and I had to wake up and since then I've not gotten any any sleep so I just gave Genesis food and after that he's going to take his bath so I'm going to try and use that time to you know try and sleep Make I see him, make I see him. Mm -hmm. So I said this morning that the um, baby's placenta fell off. For robot people, they have something that they do to the navel to make it heal and pinnacle, pinnacle. So this is pancanial pomade. I don't know if you guys know what pancanial pomade is, but it's like coconut oil. Okay. But it's from you know how you get coconut oil from coconuts. You get this one from Banga. It's it's a long process to make anyway, so don't bother. My mom made it herself, and then she's going to put all of this inside the white handkerchief. Please let me turn the camera so they see what they're. So my mom just finished bathing him with scent leaf water. Apparently she said it's for cold and cough and to be honest, I'm done arguing with her because there are so many things. Now I'm burning the palm cannel, um and all the plenty spice that she puts. I'm burning it here. I burnt it in that pot. Let me see what they're going to use. If, they are, if she, she's going to use to press the baby, I'm just going to run away. So it's past one in the morning. One, it's past one a.m. I am exhausted. Like yesterday, I basically lost it. All I wanted was just like five minutes of sleep and I couldn't even get it there were a lot of things to do and I just I almost lost this thing short. I was just angry I was just restless but I was able to sleep after um, the baby's bath and food and I woke up like around past 12 so I just realized now that I'm not even built for anything to wear. I mean, I'm having this christening this morning. Um, I don't have anything to wear. I don't even, I'm not even doing anything to my hair. So I'm just going to um, try and straighten out one of my wigs. So I look like a human being. Because right now, I don't even know who this person is. So I'm just going to straighten the wig. See if I can get more sleep before everything start getting crazy and oh in case you're not in nigeria you're wondering why is there so much noise my dear this is life here in nigeria there's no light in some areas okay maybe some people have like where i am there's no light so you have to run your gen all through the morning if you really really want to sleep well so everybody's gen is like on and everything just like blah, 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 blah. Even if you cannot sleep with the noise, you have to learn personally. That's the hustle. You basically have to pray to God to give you light that was supposed to get from God. Right? <sighs> to be honest, it's like the best I can do this night. And the one advice a lot of pregnant women or a lot of women who have giving bed before a lot of mothers the one advice they gave me was as soon as your baby goes to bed you have to sleep as well so that's it guys i'll see you guys so let me try and sleep before tomorrow starts or oh, it has started already said what am i saying <laughs> I just pity you because some of these pictures are not getting to you.
Thank you so much for watching. This is the very first week of having baby Genesis. Say hi, Genesis. Where is he? Mm. It's not sleeping. So this is the first week and it has been it's been a lot. My, my pastor's wife actually told me, you know what, NY, forget about sleep. Just forget about sleep. So I think that's what I'm going to do. 